Okay, I'm at Resurrection Cemetery here, and I'm visiting uh, my old teacher's uh, gravesite, Mr. Barr. I kind of made this an annual uh, tradition. This is the third time I visited his grave, and uh, I leave a letter on his grave uh, every year because he. When you say you can't do something, it makes me try even that much harder. I'm just a stubborn SOB. And I can imagine Mr. Barr in the afterlife is probably uh, rolling his eyes, but uh, here goes my video. I left a letter on his grave and here's his grave. I also left, there's the letter. Here's his gravestone. And there's a copy of a book I wrote. I'm not going to leave the book, but I just thought Mr. Barr's in my book, and I thought I'd pay a good tribute to him. But anyways, here's the contents of the letter. I'm going to read it for you. I have a laminated copy here. And it says something like this. Dear Mr. Barr, it's April 26, 2019. Dear Mr. Barr, well, I thought I would fill you in on the latest. Hope you are paying attention in the hereafter or the great theater in the sky. This is my third letter to you, and I thought I would fill you in on my acting pursuits. On August 13th and August 14th, 2018, I received a call back from the I Group, which is the talent agency that agreed to sign me. On August 24, 1st, I auditioned for the lead role of Scrooge in A Christmas Carol, a musical. I earned the role the following day. On September 29, 2018, I was in Fairmount, Indiana, and I entered the James Dean Lookalike Contest. Even though I do not look at all like James Dean, I figured I could at least impress the judges by acting like him. Even though I did not win, I had fun doing it. On the weekend of November 10th and 11th, I finally got to perform in my first lead role as Scrooge at the First English Evangelical Lutheran Church right across the street from our old stomping grounds, Gross Point North High School. I decided to take a break, a brief break from acting to promote a book I authored called Stuff in the Basement, Influences of James Dean. I had it self-published. Guess what? You are featured in the book on pages 35 to 36, page 42, and pages 345 to 348. I can imagine you rolling your eyes, but I figured if you could not promote me to stardom, Perhaps I would promote you to stardom. Hope all is well, and do not forget to put in a good word for us all. Regards, George W. Farrell, Gross Point North High School, Class of 1986. And that's it, my friend. See you later.